my crafty friends and welcome back to our first show of the afternoon this is our craft vault so it's going to be an absolutely fantastic tuesday afternoon we've got craft vault and then we're going into launch party later on i'm so glad you came back to join us because it's going to be so much fun now craft vault you know how we do our craft vault it's fast it's furious it's all about those amazing amazing deals we're going to be this is sort of a, a black friday craft vault so there's going to be some amazing savings to be had um it's exactly the same team we've still got dean and charlotte in the gallery they're saying hello and we've still got alex on the socials she's there she's waving hello and in the studio She's got a frothy coffee ready. I can oh, see it there. Absolutely. Is our Debbie. <clears throat> Hello. Yes, because I didn't have time to finish it before we you started. Because I've been in a meeting, been to see some people, been to meetings. And I thought, I need my frothy coffee before I start the show. So. So you're on, on it's in brand. A, I'm on brand, so you're it's okay. Brand. I can keep it there, uh, just to keep um, the lubrication going there, because we have got a lot to show you. And I, I, I'm seriously, I love Black Friday deals. I'm not going to mm. lie; it's the one time of the year that I tend to be able to shop around for really good deals, shop around for great presents, um, <clears throat> treats for myself. Yeah. Just saying, because this is what's going to be for you. Treats for yourself too. Uh, but it's the best time of the year and the best savings. And boy, oh boy, have we got some for you. We gave them a little sneak peek we did, earlier we did. on, Corinne, with some of them. And we'll, we'll repeat those. For those that have just woken up, we'll repeat those as well. So, yeah, it's going to be a great show. And also a chance for anybody asking any questions. If you yep. want to see something cut out, let me know. I'm here. I've got everything inside of me. I can do that for you. Just let us know um, on the socials and Alex. Uh, we'll pass those through for us um, so yeah can't wait to get started brilliant well thank you so there's a few people in already michelle knits for you says good morning all kathy leah says hello everyone wishing you all a beautiful day and lynn blackledge says good afternoon alex will keep passing the comments through as they come so shall we dive straight into the first one it's only three minutes past let's see how many of these we can get through now these are the festive frames so they are sentiment dies you get four different sentiment dies and then your frames as well so you're going to get 12 dies in total so you're going to get on each set you're going to get a fret an outside one a frame and your sentiment now i'm going to show you two squares and two rectangles and the sentiments are interchangeable between like the squares or interchangeable between the rectangles well actually you could they don't have to just be within their own shape you can mix and match them i love this one so this is the what's it called it's just um the noel i haven't got a name on the back but look at those snowflakes absolutely gorgeous that would look lovely as a stencil as well so there's no cutting blade on the inside so it gives you the matte layer there's no cutting blade around the outside of there so if you want to cut it out like we've done here you use this second die on the outside if you want to cut it into your cardstock uh, see if I can find one just like this I know it's a different sentiment but bear with me you see the concept if you want to cut it into your cardstock then you use it without that outside frame so this is Noel I love that then you've got uh, joy now remember you can use oops i can't hold everything that i was trying to hold the joy die would fit in the center where noel was and vice versa but the thing about this joy one is when it's cut out look at that yes it's christmasy i can see that imagine doing that with your um sunflower papers oh yes. yes the yellows wouldn't it look gorgeous and festive you know that sort of seasonal that spring really good another one beautiful for paper piecing that would look beautiful then we've got peace so we've got peace and xmas are our rectangular ones now look at peace here imagine paper piecing the center of each of those stars wouldn't that look gorgeous now the peace and the xmas will interchange between the two and then xmas is the holly absolutely gorgeous but you want to see what they look like when they're cut out so that one we've not used the outside die this one we've done it so it's a bit like the shape of the card that our debbie made this morning very similar isn't it yep. so she's cut they've cut it into the card and then they've used the <laughs> outer frame to cut the matte layer on as well no yes they have as well there i was trying to work that one out then we've got our noel on a stepper card again using it as a drop shadow and again there seems to be a lot of drop shadows with this one the joy isn't that gorgeous I love that one again cutting it into the cardstock then using that outside one to create that frame so however you want to do this now these should be 67 pounds 96 
or $79, I think $79.80. Not today. You are saving just a little bit more than you are spending because today's price for these is £33 or $39. But if you're platinum, it's going to go right down to £26.40 or $31.20. Still time to make your Christmas cards. I should know because I've not started. Um, <laughs> I have been saving cards as I've been going along through the year. I I've do that. I've got a box. <laughs> we, they still need a, quite a bit of tinkering. We'll get there. Um, so if you want these today, £26.40, £31.20. Uh, $31 That's going to give you, look at that, 12 dies in total. Amazing, amazing deal. What deal have you got? Wait till you see, Corinne, what I've got. Wait I till you wait. see all the details that are going to... Shall we do it, Charlotte? Shall we do it? Ready? Go. Oh, no, Charlotte, no! Oh, the clicky, do you remember last week? <laughs> if you saw last week, you'll totally get what I mean. <laughs> but seriously, look at the deal on the Frosty and Bright collection. Or shall we say it's a selection of the collection, one of the most beautiful Sarah signature collections that she's done at Christmas. Mm. Look at the price on the screen in the white box before you even take off any club membership. We're talking £13 or $17. Look at that saving. This is sensational. Now, for me, one of the main items in this collection was this beautiful, edible mm tree it's modern it's stylish i could see this sitting in our lovely hottie scotty's room right now have you seen his have you seen his posts he's got them all up he yeah. bet me to it he bet me and debbie did mine's out but not quite up oh, uh, no. but not seriously yet. a beautiful beautiful contemporary tree um, and it does create um, an on the edge factor where you can pop that onto the edge of your cardstock but because of the dies it allows you to create a, a full topper piece as well I love this die set it's absolutely beautiful look at the intricate detail on there as well so that's part of the deal one great big die we've got one of our fabulous on the edge dies in the merry and bright form and again it cuts over the edge and then stays connected into the cardstock, the bright part of it. Absolutely love this die. And again, lots of lovely things that you can be doing with it. It could be on the edges of your boxes, around the base of your boxes. It could be just literally one of those cards that are made simple and easy. And because it says the Merry and Bright, keeps it nice and easy as well. So that's the other die set. Really useful die set here in the Christmas tree foliage. Uh, because you've got all of those gorgeous branches, those hollies, those bows, really lovely. And do you know down here, Corinne, the star? Do you know what? If you told me that that set alone was £13, I'd pay I, wouldn't, I wouldn't... Hesitate. It'd be no. straight in there. Uh, absolutely. And it, it really is a lovely set of dies enabling you to create lots of... You could be making wreaths with this. Could be in that little finishing detail onto your makes. So that's the third die. Then we've got a set of stamps. And the stamps in themselves... It's Christmas. You don't need anything else. Um, and you customise it to whatever it is you want because it's a stamp set that says Merry and then the die is the Christmas. But then you can customise it so you could be wishing you a joyous Christmas or Merry Christmas and then a Happy New Year. Uh, Merry Christmas with all the trimmings, honestly. Or my favourite, Christmas filled with warmth for family, friends and fun. Um, I absolutely love that uh, set. And again, for the price on the screen, I'd instantly pay that. But look at this. We're not done. I thought it said that, oh, and yeah. I couldn't see it. Yeah. Like, oh, she's gilding, it. gilding what? Uh, gilding wax, gilding flakes with the stamp. And I say the stamp set. You've got the gilding flakes, the glue, and the lovely lit, the buffer, the, bu the burnisher, the, the buffer, the burnisher, the one that creates that lovely foil technique. All of that for that price on the mm. screen for thirteen pounds or seventeen dollars. But you've not taken off your Club Inspire. Look at that purple box. This is the lowest you could be going today if you're brand new to Club Inspire today or you're one of our thousands and thousands of Platinum members. £10.40 here in the UK or $13.60. And if this was the only collection, the Christmas collection that you were going to go for, that price, I think that price justifies it in an heartbeat. Take a look at some of the lovely makes that our fabulous design team have used using some of these pieces. That's that beautiful Christmas. Uh, it really is a gorgeous one. I love what Nicola did with that because she's done a, a dual ax aspect. Using the gilding uh, flakes, though, this is what you could be doing as well. Die cut it, do it with a self-adhesive sheet or pop your glue over the top and then literally create that lovely uh, foiled finish. And then a last couple of ones there. In fact, get that the right way around. Oh, no, that is. That's the right way around because it's that lovely foil. 
foliage, oh, darling, nice. foliage, where you can build up your wreaths. And then you've got the merry and bright um, in that lovely edgeable, which means you can create these kind of cards, and it just is absolutely exquisite. For me, what does it for me? It's not, it's not the cards. It's not those. I mean, they look beautiful. It's that. Mm, it's that look at the price that's a really cracking deal thank you dean for giving me that one because it is absolutely a belter of a deal to get yourself started into the world of christmas into a little bit of a sorry singe collection but take advantage of that selection of that collection at that phenomenal price brilliant so if you want that one pop it in your basket today because these are the prices that we've got these for today absolutely amazing amazing value loads of people come in i think alex was just catching up because we've now got carletta in every morning from arkansas we've got um betty um throp black says hello from houston in texas phil watson says good afternoon all christina sayer she says hello from a gray lincolnshire in tidying up my craft space thank you for keeping me company well it's a pleasure christina i hope you're actually making some headway and getting there there alison gibson says hello again from belfast i'm off to hospital later so this is my distraction well i hope it all goes well alison and we're sending you lots of healing love and best wishes um, and I hope your hospital appointment goes okay we've got Jay Pressy and says such great deals they really are and UHC we've got some even better deals what's well, even more deals coming through Rhonda Crowley creation says good morning Debbie Corrin CTV crew team social and all my creative crafty friends from a rainy cold oak park in Chicago do you know what it's a perfect day for staying in and doing a bit of crafting while you're watching us on ctv alicia garden says good morning and greetings from arkansas peace and love to everyone good morning alicia wendy meyer says i keep thinking that i'm just going to watch and be inspired yeah sounds good then the deals show up oh my poor credit card yes i know your pain there we go kirsty d says good afternoon everyone i think i'm being tormented by printers today this morning the one at work played up now my printer's turned itself off timed out and gave me a fright yeah electrics they're just not good are they uh oh wendy myers she's super excited for the first of december where are we? it's 21st you've got about 10 days to go wendy advent calendar yeah you are being good and you're waiting on yours well done um pat oh teaching dem demarest sorry i'm so apologize for that pat demarest i think it is good morning for me from me from a dreary and cool new jersey well good morning wendy myers is painting the tree with shimmer paint is that your christmas tree painting the tree with shimmer tree painting the christmas tree with the shimmer paints it the words actually say Ooh. painting the tree with shimmer paint oh we can we have some more information please wendy <gasps> ah does she mean that tree that tree that you that had tree that it could well be it that could tree. well be that tree we've that just shown you that's yeah because we're on a bit of a lag because it goes through to alex and then comes through to us <laughs> i think that's what she's telling us she's saying you need to paint that tree yes yes absolutely go. yes phil watson says ah the big christmas tree die upside down i thought it was festive bunting yes oh i like mm. that alex says yes you think she's talking about the christmas tree die there we go mm, i love your craft, crafty inspiration you know sometimes we look at things because we've got it on a board and we hold it up that way mm -hmm. that's the way we look at it isn't it and mm -hmm. then you go but actually if you do that or mm -hmm. you do that and you do that yeah there we are right okay i've got another amazing deal it's already up on the I think that's Dean's way of saying, Corinne, hurry up. I put your deal <laughs> up on the screen. So these actually only, he's laughing. These only actually launched very recently. What, about two months? Would you say two months ago? Um, Maybe a little bit more. It wasn't long, was it? It's not that long. I think it's, this is when we launched Christmas earlier yeah. on this year, in the summer. So it would be July to August time. Yeah, so definitely. Not that yeah. long ago, was it? August, September, so yeah coming up for maybe three months these are your shaped um card bases but you've got 43 stamps and 129 dies just remember that 43 stamps and 129 dies so first of all you've got your july 28th they launched wow so there we go july to august september to october so just coming up for four months nearly four months a week off four months wow there we, doesn't time go fast it flies <laughs> absolutely that, flies by that room, i can still remember the show when these launched yeah 
wow okay there you go so what you've got is you've got a uh, die that's going to cut out the card shape but then you've got all these extra so i love this you can have the snowman with the what i always call the wee winky wee willy winky type hat you know like your night cap then you've got the woolly hat you've got the top hat you've got his broomstick he could have antlers he's got his gloves his scarves he's got them all but just think how you can mix and match these around with other things that you've got then look at all of the stamps you've got all the facial elements you've got all of these lovely sentiments now you're getting all these just because in a sale we've not reduced any out you've got the gingerbread house i have a feeling a few people i know michelle probably did this as a 3d project i, I know jan did one it jan uh, did so it, jan did the first um 3d project and then um sarah did the crap uh, sorry sarah um because Sarah had said, oh, we need to do that as a craft along. Michelle got the craft along and that's what Michelle she did. did. Yeah. I thought we'd seen it as a 3D project. So, yeah, go back and have a look at that. But you've got all of the house elements. Look, all these little gingerbread men and the candy canes. Take them outside of the house and use them. Then all of these stamps as well. So it's your gingerbread house. Then you've got your Christmas cheer. I love this Christmas tree. Again, I'm going to show you it as a card shape in a minute. You've got all of the extras, the bunting, the presents, all of the sentiments. But look Look at all these bows, these stars, you know, little elements on here that you're going to be able to use time and time again. Then you've got your jolly penguin. Isn't he super, super cute? I am loving it. Why can't your jolly snowman have a top hat on? Why can't you have a woolly hat on? Interchange these just because they're on one set doesn't mean they can't. There you've got like your bunting as well. You've got all of these and look, you've got snowflake stamps and all of the sentiments. Do you know what? I sometimes wish I could leave every die set and stamp set on my craft desk because you get to it and you go, I need a snowflake stamp. And then you can't remember where you got it from. Now, I think I might, this one might be one that I made or I made one very, very similar to this, which is the Christmas tree. So we've used it as just a 2D on top using those presents as well. But if you wanted to make it as a card shape, oh, what have we got here? We've got an easel. There we go. Look at that. I'm going to lift it up just so that you can see because it's got an angle. How about that as a card shape? Then we've got our penguin. Isn't he absolutely gorgeous with a little pull-out box? And he is... Oh. As, uh, our Charlotte says she picked these samples because she really liked these. There we go. <laughs> and then you've got your gingerbread house. That's gorgeous, that. As a card base. Mm. Isn't that lovely? Think of all of these working on your... Um, working on your Christmas table as place settings. Look at that. Yes, you could have had that as a two a snowman, but no, we've made him into a three snowman. Really, really cute. I love the detail. And then maybe the gingerbread house on a bag. I've got some more samples, but we'll share that one with you later. Now, these should be just shy of £80 or $99. Wow, nearly $100. But you're going to get these today, £39. $49. Look at the platinum price right down there. £31.20 or $39.20. Amazing, amazing prices. Do you like crate cards? Absolutely. Always. We all oh, love crate cards. And I have been wow. a huge fan of crate cards since we launched them many, many, many years ago now. And this one is your Christmas half creator card. Are you ready? Yay! There we go, Charlotte. <laughs> At half price. So it's not only an half a crit, and there's nothing half about these creator cards, let me tell you right now. These are big, chunky, large dies. They are going to be your focal part when you make your Christmas cards. So if you ever wanted to make Christmas cards and just add a sentiment to it, this is your go-to set. Look at the price, £25 or $29. The lowest that you'll tickle away there at is if you're in the Platinum Club and you'll pick them up for less than half price because you're going to take them on for £20 or $23.20. These only launched this year as well. This is part of our, yeah, wow. from our Christmas launch. Look at the size of these dies. They're huge. They're absolutely huge. Now, the half factor, where the half creator card comes into, is because of the die that's got the little top and the bottom where it cuts out onto one side and stays connected into the other. So it creates this beautiful topper piece, if that's what you want to create. So you've got those gorgeous bells. Oh, my God, if anything were crying out to be coloured or paper piece, it is this one. Absolutely stunning. You've got the large poinsettia as well. This is super-sized. And it really is joyous. It's that's that's the name of it, joyous poinsettia. Um, absolutely beautiful. Look at the level of detail in there. 
where it half stays connected into your cardstock and the other half creates the over the edge kind paper of feel piece. as That's well. That's got to be paper pieced. Oh, one. paper pieced and coloured, absolutely. Uh, fill your boots with this one. Then you've got the Yuletide wreath, which again is absolutely beautiful. Look at the level of the detail that you're seeing in that die cut piece. And translated into craft card, well, making your cards. Look at these, absolutely glorious detail. What Marie's done with this is she's paper pieced it back in and then coloured. Looks stunning, including that fabulous wow. bell it really is i mean doesn't need anything other than a uh, like a, a, a sentiment onto their courage doesn't deserve absolutely incredible that's what creates all about though isn't it debbie it's exactly it is it creates a card instantly um, and not just cards though corinne because you can take it into your box making as well uh, a beautiful box if you wanted to present that way you know you can see what's going off inside there for your prezi absolutely gorgeous adding that acetate onto there keep it really nice and simple bit of craft card bit of gold card and look how exquisite that looks add a sentiment it's christmas made easy whatever it is that you want to put on the inside absolutely stunning and then lastly a bit similar to the well it is it's the same style this uh, morning what i did but look how gorgeous ah, so that instead looks. of putting it going down the, the, the cut going down the middle we put it across the <coughs> going horizontally absolutely. Put it vertically honestly so much you can do with creator cards and the way that these have been created to give you the off factor as in off cut out off stays in just means for you as a crafter you've got endless opportunities but what you haven't got is then this opportunity to get hold of it because seriously and these black friday deals that we've got running right now through our craft vault look at the price either one of those prices is superb three huge dies that can create multiples of multiples of different cards i absolutely love them they are a beautiful amazing price absolutely amazing 20 pounds or 23 dollars 20 but those three large dies is brilliant value now i think you must have all heard that we've got this super pet fast paced show going on because you're all in now watching um, i think you're all here for the deals betty weaver's in hello from uh, idaho mary shaw says good morning or afternoon to everyone well good morning to you mary if that's where you are My, um, wendy my says the gingerbread house is so very adorable it really is jane adams says hi again everyone from Las Vegas try to go back to sleep but no luck you only could could do worse than watching us I think I think um, Brenda Munro says good morning everyone from a rainy Michigan and Pat says I love this set Christmas shape card dies and stamps yes absolutely brilliant there you go now I have got another one it's up here the layering stamps now how about getting 38 stamps and seven dies for £10.40. You're going to say it can't be done, $13.60. Well, it can. These are your layering dies. Uh, so there's the board to show you, but I actually want to show you the pack. So what you've got is you've got all of the stamps that then layer up one on top of each other to create the scene. Now, each stamp, when you get it, if I can, I'm going to just open it, is numbered. There you go, you can see this. If I can, is that white on the back of there? Yep, there we go. Each one is numbered. So it tells you, there's number one. So you stamp that one first. Then you've got number two. And then on this one, you've got, you've got the, sort of the, the, the sun coming out and then you've got all the extras. But what you actually have is you have a little, that's in a right angle corner there. And so you line that up on your stamping platform and then you know that each layer is going to go one on top of each other. So absolutely perfect. So you've got that one. So that one is, oops, let me put that one there. There we go. That one is uh, the reason for the season really lovely if you do like traditional nativity then you've got festive foliage now this one is really good and i'm i'm sure i was with our michelle the other week and she did this one she did a beautiful beautiful card um looked really really beautiful was it card or box i forget but it was ever so pretty and then we have the festive wreath again you just layer it up and the, it sort of gives you some clues on the packet so if you look at this one this is the corner it says do number one then do number two and then you can cut it out and it gives you the holly just like that so that's this one here you see on here you'd layer these up and then cut it out with the die just there to cut out the corner if you want to or you can have them on your cardstock 
£10.40, $13.60 for these. So you can be doing gorgeous diorama cards like that with the um, reason for the season. You've got the um, festive wreath on here on a lovely Z fold card. Love the colours of that, something a little bit different. Or how about decorating up your bags with that gorgeous corner die and you don't have to have a whole front to a card. How about just like that? £13 or $17 before your um, Club Aspire, Inspire discount. How about that? Absolutely amazing. Okay, so have you got one? Are you going to be all about the Christmas corners, are oh, Debbie? My goodness, wait till you see the price on this one. Charlotte, are you ready? Oh no! Charlotte, you forgot the memo. Remember? Remember? <laughs> Now, come and have a look at this. £14 or $19 for the Christmas corner dies. Oh, my God, look at the price. Look at the price. £11.20 or $15.20 if you are part of the platinum level. Um, even at £14 and $19 for everything I wear to show you, I think is a phenomenal deal. These were the ones that I, I said to you, you're going to use them for um, embellishments. You're going to use them into the corner of your boxes. They're going to be things that you can make a focal part of your cards, of your scrapbook pages, of your home decor during Christmas. They're absolutely exquisite. And the detail on these is off the charts amazing and the lovely thing about these they're not duplicates there's two different design in each one of the sets i'm going to show you the four uh, five sets not four five sets and then you can see the 10 dies that you're going to be getting my very favorite which is why i've got it at the front is the fabulous snow crystals i love love these dies and i use these a lot in my christmas card making absolutely stunning dies the intricate detail is phenomenal that's the uh, snow crystals this one is the entwined holly look at the detail in the holly paper piece them color with them use whatever cardstock you want to to create uh, beautiful features and accessorize that's how i'm going to call these like an accessory die um, ring out those bells absolutely phenomenal and again the christmas decor look at the christmas decor we could have stuck with one you know one die uh, sorry two dies of the same pattern but what's the point of that corinne we I want know, to give you lots useful, of creativity yeah absolutely and then lastly the poinsettia splendor or splendor however you pronounce that uh, but look this is what i'm talking about when it comes to your card making um it could be just that little bit of um a corner detail into the two corners. That's all it is on that one with some beautiful papers and lovely sentiments and you've got a fantastic Christmas card. The same applies to this one. Again, absolutely phenomenal detail on oh, them. I love that one. Tiny bit of paper piecing in that. I current. love the colours. But how stunning is it? Sometimes that less is more looks mm. really, really striking and that one's an absolutely belter that Caroline did for us. This one, again, another example of how fabulous these are and creating like a mirror image on the inside, yeah. which I just think is absolutely phenomenal. Really, really useful dies. Ones that proved really popular when we first launched these. And if I remember rightly, I launched them. Um, the corner dies are absolutely exquisite. This is one of my favorite samples. I always bring this out. This gorgeous, what Caroline did here literally popped it into four corners of a box look how stunning that is and a little bit of coloring looks incredible but of course paper piecing you want to do a bit of paper piecing let's get some paper piecing action going off in these this is exactly what you can be doing but look at that phenomenal price this is why it's in the black friday craft vault because that price is insane is that less than half price? It is. It is, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. absolutely phenomenal. And then lowest you're going to go to is £11.20 or $15.20 for dyes that you're going to use every single year. Seriously, in and out every single year you'll use these. And there'll be those go-to dyes that you have on your craft desk when it comes to your Christmas makes because it could just be that little finishing detail that you need to put on your on there. Or you can make it a focal part like, like our lovely guys have done with these samples. Absolutely phenomenal. Great price. Perfect opportunity. For you to get hold of your Christmas mates. And if you've done your Christmas cards for this year, don't worry. You'll soon be starting again next year because Christmas will be coming around yet again, it Corinne. Will. It really will. But a great, great opportunity to get them at the best ever price I've seen these at. I think Debbie made a really valid point there. There's nothing we have shown you yet today, Christmas or otherwise, that is 2023 specific. 
you're going to be able to use them in 2024, 25, and lots of years afterwards. We have had also had uh, Stephanie in. She said, hello again, Debbie Corrin, CTV team and crafty friends. Hello. Right, we're going to do a quick break because we need to give you time to just have a look ahead on the Shop the Show or Shop the Day page. Make sure you put everything in your back basket that you really want. Now, some of our items are getting to be low numbers. As we launched the show, there was nothing that was about to sell out, but I think at these prices, they're going to be going very, very quickly, and you could end up finding that some things start to go limited stock. So please, please check out your baskets as quickly as you can. We'll be back after this quick break with some more amazing deals. What makes Crafters TV so special is uh, you guys. It's really special because the the experts are really experts. They're they're um, really skilled at what they do, and they want to make sure that the audience also improves on their skills. Crafters TV is so special because you've got together a really sort of key group of people um, and people that are very passionate about the products. Crafters TV is so special because it's a unique community that we have with each other where we can learn and grow and communicate with each other. The community, the family spirit, the education, everything to do with craft. We are all like-minded people who share a passion. I love all the inspiration the demonstrators bring and all the knowledge for us out here. What makes Crafters TV so special, 100%, is the interaction. No other crafting TV channel or show has the same interaction. I love the community, I love chatting live, uh, I think that's the best part and uh, it's gone beyond crafting because we've become friends. It feels to me to be a really, really close relationship with our customers and viewers. You guys make us feel like we're part of your family. I've never been on the show before, but one of my friends who I did meet from CCTV encouraged me and I was on the craft along. A massive team of people and I think they've all got their role to play uh, and it just brings everything together. It allows us to do our job and just love it. Ah, oh, the people obviously, the people not just here at Crafts Companion, uh, but the viewers that watch us, I mean everybody. We have this real magical essence about it. Bye for now. Bye. Pokey tools and paper pads, gilding, wax and stamping mats, scissors, glitter, builder blocks, faux snow fabric, rocker blocks, Brea's misters, quilting clips, and diapers, tools, precision snips, finger daubers, acetates, stencils, glue guns, and templates. Gemini Pro, Julia and the OG. Gemini Go, Mini and the Midi. Triblend brush pens, aqua pens and aqua blends. Illustrators, classics and tri blends and color blends and glitter pens and sparkle pens, outliner pens. Fine tip glue applicators, envelope box creators, stamping platforms, box of boards, the bit score and scoreboard. Nina card and craft card, glitter card, my flat card, craft kits, wadding and adhesive sheets, glass mats, guillotines and pen trays, ball tool dice stamps, ink trays, mitre tools and binding tools and tow bugs, USBs, bone folders and punches, low tap tape and brushes, stamens, mailboard, flower form and foam. Alpine markers, DVDs, felt with triton pads and CDs, gilding flakes and washi tape, tacky glue, red liner tape, craft nice for press, sparkle pots, centura pan and sticky dots, pigment ink pads, chunky glue, body bags, all purpose glue, embossing folders, blending tools, storage folders, much more too. Water, reactive ink pads, body bags, craft magnets, gear of craft and glue, stick, stick and spray and stick away, dotty tape and split pens, acrylic paint pens, tape pens, watercolor card, rotary cutters, magazines and stamping card, ultimate Pro and the rotating design board. Opta, but first, compendium, Sarah, signature collections. And don't forget Discovery Kids. Oh, and there's foam pads. Think that's it. One final thing foam on a roll. Foam on a roll. I love it when we did put those we put those um, songs in. They are so much good. They're so much fun, aren't they? Really, really are. I am loving the deals. There are some really, really recent releases have gone into our Black Friday sale. So you're going to be able to get some amazing, amazing deals. 
The next one I've got to show you is an opaque pigment ink pad selection. You've got 10 ink pads. Now, you know our ink pads are 5 99 each. Easy, £59.90. Easy maths to do on that. Not today. We're going to offer you this £35 or $55. In dollars, these are usually $8.99. So you can see again, you're saving. But if you're platinum with that extra um, saving on there, you're going to come right down to £28 or $44. Now, pigment ink pads. I hear you ask, what is a pigment ink pad? A pigment ink pad is a slow, slower drying ink. The molecules on a pigment ink pad are much larger, so they stay wetter for longer. But, I'm trying to see if all of these, but they are, these ink pads, they look really moist. They're lovely and juicy ink pads, and you can see in there. So you've got these larger molecules that stay wet for longer, and the benefit of that is you can then add embossing powder to your inked image, whether it's stamped, whether it's over some embossing, however you want to do it. The ink, you can add the embossing powder to it, heat set it, and you've got a gorgeous embossed um, sentiment, image, background, however you want to do it. So we're going to give you green topaz and smoked emerald. I love those two together. We're going to give you... Oops. Why has that one got stuck together? Uh, we've got lemon tonic and Bordeaux, another couple of lovely ones. These are the upside down and back to front. We've got Pine Tree and Friar Brown. I'm just showing you them as two. Now you can blend with your pigment ink pads. Even though they're larger molecules, you can still um, stamp with them. They stamp so crisp and clean. You've got Parakeet and Crushed Velvet. So you've got some really beautiful colors in here. And then you've got Lagoon and damson wine so 10 ink pads in total maybe you've got some of these but remember ink pads always dry not not dry out but are used up they're a consumable so maybe you're going to be getting these for when you know when they ha yours have run out 10 ink pads in total all pigment um, absolutely amazing value 28 pounds $44. Remember, these should be £5.99 or $8.99 each. So that is a phenomenal, phenomenal saving. Yeah. Right? Yeah? For this one? Ready, okay. Charlotte? You ready, Charlotte? Ready? Ready? There we go. Oh, She's we've got it in. nailed now, Charlotte. We've got it nailed. Uh, the Christmas elements. Now, when we launched these, we launched these as a with the twist and pop mechanism. Now, you can pick, uh, even though we don't have the mechanism anymore, you can pick up templates to create a, a mechanism for the twist and pop. But what I want you to think about with these dies is these are beautiful, great big dies to create l really big toppers, whether it be on gift boxes, whether it be into cards. Uh, but of course, they were originally developed to go with a twist twist and pop which is what I've got all my sentiments to show you in a second but first of all I want you to take a look at the size of these dies and then the price on the screen £32 $35 takes it right down to the platinum price of £25.60 or $28 but look at the look at the imagery and look at the unusualness of these because of course they were meant to go inside a twist and pop but look how fabulous that is I love that scene that's the follow the star um, a really beautiful scene especially when you colour these in or you take a uh, paper piece into them I adore this one with the um, the Christmas trees or the winter forest I think if you've got stag dies or stag stamps you could be adding those to it to create a really nice forest scene and um, the cracker one the Christmas celebration I absolutely adore right now doesn't look very inspiring wait till I show you the colored in images especially with this one I adore the presents those festive gifts you can chop into these as well so you could use these um, as a topper um, or use them as they are and these are big big dies these aren't little dies that's not just Christmas that one though, no is it? it's not absolutely not now how it is designed was to work as a twist and pop and like I said you can pick up twist and pop templates online for free so I know we had a die with it, but the die is all gone now. We, and I don't think we're going to be bringing that die back in. But maybe you've got a twist and pop mechanism die. Then these will work beautifully onto there. But the size of these dies, and look how gorgeous they look when they're coloured in. They're absolutely they incredible. Really love these. Um, again, have I got the right ones here? Do you know, I'm just looking now. Let me have a quick peek. Oh, 
a little note on there. I will just have a little look. Oh, look at that, Corinne. I oh, love wow. that on the inside with your ink. Wow, that is just wow, isn't it's, it? It is an absolute wow um, when you take a look at that beautiful scene with that star over Bethlehem. It's just absolutely stunning. All those ink colours were in that bundle I just looked at. Yes, yeah. And you could be creating those with your, you know, the, I want you to think about these as not just, you know, that they're, they're, they're toppers. They could be toppers. So if I just open that up, look how gorgeous that forest scene is. And that's just cut out into miracle. God. And that's this Santa we looked at earlier. He was in one of your Yeah, exactly. Sets. You could be doing that. You might have already got some of these papers, but there's honestly so much you can do with these. They're absolutely incredible. And again, is that the Santa? I don't know if we've got the Santa's hat, so I'm not going to show you the Santa's hat one. I think someone's been picking the wrong samples here, Corinne. Uh, oh, did you pick it, Charlotte? What are you like? Did you look inside them, Charlotte? What is she like? Have you been helping out in, in, in other, other area? Oh, bless. Oh, now then, look. Are you ready? Is this the deal? Because I've not got all the boards then. Come, come across, come across, come across. Oh, my God, it's even better. There look at this. Go. Oh, my God, I'll show you those samples in a second. Because you <laughs> have got... Ready to go. I'm going closer. You've got the Santa's hats. You've got the doves. Oh, my goodness. There's two more in there. Thank you, Charlotte, for that, because I didn't... I thought you'd pick the wrong samples. I'm going to apologise to our gorgeous Charlotte, because... There was uh, a stocking one, but that's not on there. Yes, that's probably what that was then. That was what the note was. Debbie didn't look at the note. Ah! Uh, Look, look at the doves. I love that. I look at this and I see a wedding. I don't just see Christmas. Yeah. I see a wedding with the doves. Um, let me go back to my Santa's hat then because... Um, ho, 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 I love the Santa's hats. Those Santa's hats are going to be really useful as well. I mean, that could be just a topper that goes across the car. Because even though they put like a little... And I say a little score line, you can't see it. You have to reinforce these with a, with a scoreboard. So you can get away with this as a topper. All of those, then, means this is an absolute... I'm just going to do it again, because I love that. Oh, my God. <laughs> Every time I look at it, it's like, wow! That is amazing. Absolutely stunning. Do you know what? That could go on the front of a card. Look how gorgeous that would be I love onto the front of a card. I love how that star comes above the card top once it's open, but you yes. can't see it when it's shut. Yeah, absolutely. So that is an honestly really good set of dies um, and a very... Oh. I didn't see the stocking on the list. Did you not see the stocking? No. Charlotte, what you like? She let me down. She let me down. She says she didn't what put that like? How did it get in there, Charlotte? <laughs> So, but seriously, shall we go back to that screen again and just show you everything that you're getting? Because this is a whopping great big die set. £32, $35, but look at the price, $25.60 or $28 for all of those dies. That is phenomenal. They're big, huge dies that you can use a twist and pop mechanism with them, or you can simply use these as a really great big statement piece, a die top of the front of your projects. Absolutely stunning. Love them. They are. That, I mean, the value on that is phenomenal. It really, really is. Um, right, we've got Teresa Campbell here. We've got Lisa Sorensen here says, hello all. Alicia Gordon says, deals are awesome. They certainly are. Rosalind Russell says, these deals will get me in trouble. The prices are amazing. Yeah, don't think of how much you're spending. Think of how much you're saving. That's how I like to think of it. Um, Tesha says hi Debbie and Corin and we've got Lois says good morning everyone from Ohio I finally got back on there we go oh um, Amy McHale says there might be a twist and pop mechanism if you have the template library oh I, I never that. thought about thank that you. thank you Amy that's um, quite useful to know so there we go okay now I've got some cardstock this has definitely got a Christmas feel about it, but I'm thinking you're going to be using these all year round. Now, each pack is the same configuration. Ten sheets of encapsulated glitter, ten sheets of mirror, and ten sheets of satin, or matte mirror, whichever one you want to call it. So you're going to get all of those. You've also have got a little extra bit of your um, um, mirror and a little bit of extra of your satin as well. But let's think of it essentially as 30 sheets of A4. 
these are all 250 gsm but they do feel a lot more i think it's the coating on them feels a lot more you can still die cut these even though they've all got a coating on even gets a lot of your intricate dies through this you might need to put your metal shim underneath you know the one that you use with those intricate dies but they will cut beautifully so this is your gold it's a really lovely sort of what do you call it almost a, it's not champagne gold but it's sort of along those tones isn't it then you've got your green and how luxurious is that it's not a cheap and nasty green it's not garish it's really really expensive so again 10 of each of the configurations then you've got your silver now i have to apologize this has obviously got a piece missing you do have silver mirror you've got this in glitter the mirror which has disappeared and the um, satin as well and finally you are going to get the blue now this uh, this is one of my favorite encapsulated glitters because it's silver but it's got quite a blue hue to it then you've got the um mirror and then you've got the satin as well so you have got four lots of 30 120 sheets now each one of these is normally 9.99 let's say 10 pound for argument's sake 10 pound that's 40 pounds worth of card if you are platinum it's 20 pounds or 32 dollars 80. it's half price yeah more or less if you're platinum it's half price which is absolutely amazing deal and again these colors are going to last all year round so yeah really really good deal oh nefertiti's come in she says hello everyone hello nefertiti so right i think debbie's got another one Charlotte. <clears throat> <You> ready? <laughs> Just a minute, she's not ready. Look at this. The Christmas floral <laughs> stamp and die collection. And it's the whole of them. It's not just one or two of them, it's everything you're away to see. Oh my God. When you're looking at that price on the screen, £25 or $30 is a fabulous price for not one set, not two set, not three sets, not four, but six sets sets is what we're going to say because literally this is incredible when you think about how much you're getting for your money today lowest you'll pay today is 20 pounds or 24 dollars come and have a little look let me delve you into the world of the christmas floral stamp and die sets and the reason why these are so fabulous are they're really big stamps they're really big dies as well they're absolutely phenomenal and they're split into two ways so that you can create an on the edge um, of either side left or right look absolutely sensational they really are absolutely beautiful and the stamps alone could be used on their own but they've even got sentiments in there so that's your fabulous um better the bow one that christmas bow uh, absolutely beautiful the festive poinsettia is the other one one of my favorites i know craig that's loves this one it? oh it's absolutely stunning and i'll show you a few samples in a second you can see a little bit of the world of what you can create with them though again each one of these floral stamps has has that main focus stamp it then has the dies that cut out either side left right or a full topper and then even on the smaller section you've got a die cut there so there's no fussy cutting involved uh, the winter um the winter blessings is that gorgeous uh, winter flower there looks stunning again another beautiful one there um all the stamps all the sentiments the dies to boot as well that's your four uh, third set we're not done. You've still got the rest of here. This is honestly a phenomenal price. The bells are absolutely gorgeous. And again, all the bell stamps, including the smaller piece, it could be two corner pieces if you wanted it to be, all the sentiments and the dies to do all the fussy cutting for you. The festive banner, always a lovely one. This looks beautiful when it's coloured in as well. And again, all the stamps. And with this one, you can actually pop whatever it is that you want into that banner. So you've got a selection of sentiments that you can pop in and customise. And then lastly, that beautiful uh, Cozy by Candlelight stamp and die set absolutely phenomenal and these like i said um they're really big beautiful stamps and dies this was a lovely one that michelle um demonstrated absolutely gorgeous this is that lovely edgeable factor with one of the dies being used and then this one here has been die cut fully which is again you don't have to fussy cut so you're not having to worry about getting that line perfect it's done for you um, of course because it is a stamp and die set you can make these as big or as little as you want look at the size of this wow it's absolutely gorgeous 
And what I love what Alison's done with this is the colouring. She's coloured onto craft card using pencils and pay. Um, honestly, these are colour blend pencils. Look at the change there instantly from alcohol colouring to pencil colouring, from using one dice and stamp set to using them all to create that beautiful wreath. The bows are stunning as well. These are really lovely big pieces. That looks uh, really modern, doesn't absolutely, it? Absolutely, yeah. T any colouring medium, because it's a stamp, you can use any colouring medium. Love this one. Again, this has been heat embossed. Ah, and then yeah. it's absolutely the colouring on there makes oh isn't that just glorious? What's Look it at that. With? Pens or it pencil? looks like it's being coloured with um alcohol pens. All right. So it's been gold embossed, so it's been a gold heat embossing. But then using alcohol pens to colour absolutely gorgeous and then lastly um that beautiful poinsettia with the bow on there again look how fabulous these can be and these can go anyway so if i pop it the right way that should be turned the other way or you could have it that way and have the banner going down i think that's where it meant to go don't you i love it either way it looks absolutely phenomenal so all i would do is if i were it that way i'd just turn that round but again really lovely stamps and die sets absolutely phenomenal but do you know what it is for me is that the price on the screen for not one set but six sets that's six lots of stamp sets six lots of die sets in these beautiful um absolutely stunning images when it comes to christmas and when you line them up side by side and you get to see the true value of what you're paying for today this is absolutely phenomenal. £25 or $30. You then take off your Club Inspire membership. The lowest, if you're a platinum member or new to Club Inspire today, is £20. What does that work out at? £3.33 a set. Thank you very much, Corinne. You know, just, did you notice I came straight to you then? You did. Straight over, I thought, I'll leave Dean. I'll leave him. It's fine. <laughs> Dean, I know Dean you have to get his calculator out like me. Solar, solar calculator doesn't work in that dark room. <laughs> <laughs> but what a crack. Isn't that a cracking deal? It is. It for is some really, really beautiful, stunning art. It's artwork is what that is. Absolutely gorgeous. Get yours today. If that's been something you've been sat and thinking, I can't really afford that price that's got the red line through it or any of the other deals that we've brought. This is the lowest we've ever brought these to you today and I absolutely think that is a phenomenal deal. It really, really is. And you are loving these. Um, Carol D um, sent a couple of messages saying, good morning shoppers, I mean crafters. I'm just able to take a quick peek in on the deals before heading out for another day helping my sister move into assisted living home. So much work. Yes, I'm sure it is, but uh, well done for you for helping your sister. Um, she can't wait to get home and start making holiday cards. She's driving to her nieces for Thanksgiving and Friday is when the OG really starts earning its keep. Oh, you're getting all your Christmas cards ready. Wow. Um, good luck with today, Carol. I hope you have a fantastic Thanksgiving and good luck getting on with those cards. Uh, Laura Simmons says, um, Corinne, thanks for putting the silver and blue glitter next to each other. You can really see the blue in the glitter card, otherwise it really looks silver. It is, I'll grab them back from here. When you put the two together, you can really, can you see this is the silver silver and this is the blue silver. Oh look, you can really see the blue popping out from there, can't you? I love that, it depends on what I'm using it with. Sometimes I use it as a silver card, even though it's got that blue tint to it it really is gorgeous it's working out at five pound a pack which is brilliant um glad you like that laura so i hope that helped uh, Rhonda crowley creation says wowzers trousers these prices are absolutely sensational they really really are and we've got even more as well and carol burns says good afternoon corin debbie and crew from a very cold dublin island now We've got a couple of minutes till we're into the second half of the show and I think I've got time to show you this because I don't unfortunately have any finished samples. This is an amazing deal. So these should have been £15 a set and you're going to get them for about £3.50 per set if you are platinum today. So these are your, let me read it right, stamp and die Christmas embellishments. So you're going to get all three of these. You're going to get your festive embellishments I'm going to turn it round and let our Charlotte show you. Look at this. So you're getting the wreaths, the foliage, you're getting a spray, you're getting all of those. And each stamp has its own die with that. You've got your frosted embellishments. So it's all about the snow and the frostiness. And again, look at that. You've got the snowman in the stamp. You've got some poncettia corners. You've got bells. You've got bows. And again, all of the dies. And the third set is called woodland embellishments. 
So it's as you expect. Look at that. You've got that gorgeous stag. You've got the trees. You've got the cottage. These are seen building stamps if you want to just do that that is absolutely brilliant you're going to get the first one you're going to get that one which is woodland embellishments you're going to get frosted embellishments and you're going to get festive embellishments remember th so look at that you have got 32 42 44 elements in total on there that is brilliant value these should be as i said 15 pounds each you're going to get today's price before you discount you're going to get all three sets for 13 pounds or 17 dollars so you're going to get all three sets for less than the price of one which is really really amazing amazing value so which of these have you seen that you are really loving has there been something that we have shown you today that you have absolutely loved i mean how much have you saved? I mean, I think it was Gaz that did it once and he put in, he said, I've spent this much and I've saved this much. I mean, this is when it blows your mind, when you find how much you can be saving with these. Which one? Okay, Debbie, you've got two minutes before we before we go to the break. Well, not the break, the halfway point. Well, I showed you this sneaky deal earlier on in the wake-up call and this is a stellar deal. Wait, to, I mean, she did it before the click. I'm going to let you off this time. £15 or $17 for three sets of stamps and dies are absolutely incredible. Initially launched to create the scenes of light where you pop your LED lights behind the back. This is a, ultimately a beautiful die set. So we're going to start with the first one, which is the rooftops of light. All the dies in there to create these beautiful pop-out features that you can see on the front of the packaging. I love these die sets. They are absolutely phenomenal and they take centre stage either on the front of your cards or on the inside of your cards and I mean wow look how incredible these are make your project fully pro it just looks stunning when it's all created and I'll just show you another fabulous one there initially these were used to create that lovely light up scene behind the back of them you could make your star uh, books with these as well there's so many things that you can do with them but it's an incredible amount of dies and stamps that you're getting for the price that you're seeing on the screen uh, the next one is the village of light so you've got that lovely country scene to this one and again the front of your card looks incredible but it's when you open it up and make that pop out in the center and add all those scenes to build up that beautiful story to tell absolutely incredible i mean i love that one i'm not gonna lie absolutely adore that front looks beautiful but when they open it up it's a real wow factor and um, so that's your uh, village one and then lastly the fairies of light so it's all about the fairies it's all about the enchanted dreams and those kind of things um and that lovely world that fantasy world stunning die set sentiments in there to boot as well beautiful front but look at the inside this is what you can be creating you've got all the dies to create the archways to create the scenes to build up whatever story it is that you want to tell um, i absolutely adore these i think they're phenomenal the value that you're seeing on the screen it's the lowest price we've ever 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 given these out for you it might be your opportunity to pick up three die sets three stamp sets in there 15 pounds 17 dollars but that club platinum price brings it right down to 12 pounds that's four pounds a set or 13 dollars 60 an absolutely stellar deal you took advantage this morning a wake up call maybe it's right now your turn to get hold of yours and take advantage of that one it's a honestly a steal um, at that price get yours while you can thank you debbie it really really is now I've lots of lovely question, um, comments coming in from you, but no one's really asking any qu um, questions. If we've whizzed over anything and there's anything you want to know, sizes or any questions about anything that we've seen or anything that you've seen on the um, Shop the Show de um, page, then please send them in and Debbie and myself will try and answer them in the second part of this show. We've still got loads and loads of amazing deals. I'm going to talk about this showstopper in just a minute because there are some amazing amazing deals to come up which ones have you got have you really really got some amazing deals i hope you have and we're going to carry on with plenty more there we go right 
now into the second hour of this two hour show this amazing craft vault it's all about the black friday craft vault deals up to and i've even seen some at just over 70 percent savings sissy hastings said much needed rain coming down in north carolina so it's a great day to play with my sarah stuff as my husband calls it her sarah stuff i love that okay now i want to show you this i did mention this if you were watching in wake up call we had a really good in-depth look at this one and uh, we're going to be looking at this a lot more in our launch party but i didn't want you to miss out on this again now this is our showstopper deal for our crafters inspiration magazine issue four obviously if you want to just buy the magazine on its own when i say it on its own that's the magazine with the papers with all the free gifts everything that's inside that box then you can but if you want to get this at an amazing price with 150 bonus points down there then this is what you're going to get you're going to get your magazine in the box with all the freebies you're going to get your 12 sheets of heavy weight foiled acetate beautiful foiling on there you're going to get your precious metal cardstock 40 sheets beautiful in there it's sort of across five colors and you've got um, glitter card adhesive card mirror card you've got them all in there you've got your wild at heart embellishments you've got your foam pads your foam roll and right down there you've got your gilding wax as well your beautiful gold gilding wax an amazing deal all of this today 40 pounds or 50 dollars it should be over 72 pounds or 93 dollars if you were to buy each of those in items individually now 40 pounds 50 dollars sounds amazing i like this price even better 32 pounds or 40 dollars that's your platinum price don't forget as i've already mentioned the one 150 bonus points if you're already up getting close to the next level that 150 bonus points is probably going to push you up to the next level debbie i've mentioned that this is a magazine in a box with some freebies yes what are my freebies oh what i'm not sure yeah in a box, please? The, the first thing that i did with this corinne was i went straight to that centerpiece to call my papers out i yeah. always do when i go to a magazine i love the fact that we've gone back to the traditional um as, it, as I call it, the traditional box. This is where we first started when we launched our magazines. And I'm going to say now, oh God, it must be about eight, nine, ten years ago since we, we, we first launched our Crafters Inspiration. And it's lovely to go back to that original one where you pop everything in your box, you know where it is. It doesn't take up much shelf space either. It's absolutely phenomenal. But for me, it's, it's about the craft kit that we give it. And this, for me, is what I think we've really changed the game now, is everything that's focused in the craft kit is the majority of the projects that's in here. And I love that because if you've got the craft kit, you want the inspiration, you want those projects. And like I said, 95% of everything that's in this magazine is based around the free, the freebies, as I call it. Um, and it's an extension of our Wild at Heart collection that we launched recently with our lovely Sarah. We love it. Corinne loves it, I love it. We, we literally fight over the shows when we want to get yep. out because we absolutely adore the collection. But this is like an extension to it. So anything that you've got in that collection, don't think you're going to duplicate anything. So I'm going to show you and take you through it. I think I'll show you the papers first, though, because you can get hold of the papers. But today, here in your magazine, you have got some phenomenal double-sided sheets in here. Now, I did write down... Let me just move my magazine out of the way, Corinne, because I had to write down exactly what you were getting. So you're getting 12 sheets. They're all double-sided and they've got 12 designs on each side so you can see if I just lift them up all of these beautiful sheets it's like 24 all together when you look at it it's not just that though it's sentiments as well and I'll take you through them but you can see that gorgeous wild at heart collection running through there so all those papers that are in the 12 by 12 and the 6 by 6 we've replicated into this form a4 so if this consumable finishes, you've got the option of getting the 12 by 12. And all I will say to you is go and have a little look at the website because we still do have that. It's on Shop the, Shop the Show, I think it is, because mm -hmm. we've got them on as well. Um, now, I've been using this, so you're going to bear with me. Um, however, when I take mine out, I actually pop them straight onto some back of like white card or Centura Pearl to give them a bit of rigidity because the sentiments, I want to be able to um, have some rigidity to it. 
Paper's fine, but not for a sentiment. So that's why I pop it onto there. Um, and you can see these beautiful sentiments. So that's that's what it should look like. <laughs> let's, let's put it as it is. You've got fabulous sentiments on there. You've even got some little background papers and lots of lovely ones on the bottom. So you're getting two sheets of those. And then let's go to the one that I'm being chopped into. Two sheets here with two different ones. Everything complements each other. All works with the collection that you're getting as well. Um, and I just think that is absolutely phenomenal that you're getting those in the middle of your magazine. Do what I do. Take it out. Because if you keep it in that magazine, I can guarantee you use it. you're not going to use it. Get it straight out, chop up to it straight away. And then you've also got the free gifts, so we'll go through those for you. So you've got this fabulous Wild at Heart die set, which is that gorgeous love heart, all that intricate detail with that leopard print running through there. I absolutely love that one. Um, the stencil is stunning. You saw, if you caught the wake-up call, I did a demonstration with that one in particular. You've got a fab fantastic set of stamps in there and also you've got this beautiful 2d embossing folder so that's your freebies that you're getting and then look at the projects come on let me bring you into the magazine let's give you a little flick through very quickly uh, because there's lots of projects in here and then step-by-step -step instructions so to make this beautiful card and it really is beautiful it's got it's onto some acetate and it's created this lovely design and then the aperture's being cut out well the lovely guys and girls who have contributed to this magazine, they're going to show you how to make it. They're going to tell you what you need. They're going to take your step-by-step -step instruction so you can be creating something as beautiful as that one. <gasps> I get drawn to it every time, Corinne. I can't help it. It's absolutely stunning. I love this one. Using that beautiful art, cut out into different kinds of mirror card and placed onto some acetates. Again, step-by-step -step picture instruction showing you how to do it. One of my favourites, I'm going to do something very similar later on tonight. Um, this is beautiful. Again, step-by-step -step instruction. A little bit of how versatile this stamp set is, what you can do with your inks and how you can create that lovely ghosting effect. Mm -hmm. um, our lovely Sarah Jackman-Reed, she's going to take you through step-by-step uh, -step instruction into there. Lots more other projects. You can see I already, like, I put little marks in mine. I love this that Amy Wilkes has done. It's just beautiful. And I'm going to attempt that one because I think it's stunning. And again, step-by-step -step instructions on how to do it. All of these, you'll see, all of these projects are using that fabulous kit that you're getting as well. So it really is incredible that you're getting a magazine that's jam-packed full with hints and techniques and there's lots and lots and lots of projects to get your crafty mojo going, your creative juices flowing. It's absolutely phenomenal. It really is an all thriller no filler magazine pinched my nigel may's uh, little step they used to tell me every time i used to work with him down um down south uh, but honestly it's absolutely incredible so for me with the showstopper deal i think it's just fun it's fantastic with what you're getting with it but you do have the option to get the magazine on its own as well so seriously one of those magazines that you'll reach to when you have that little they call it a writer's block in the world of writing. We call it a crafter's block. Yeah, we do. We literally, when we have that block and we just can't think what to do, it'll inspire you. Some of those projects in there have inspired me with some of my makes that I'm going to be doing later on in launch party. Not quite copied them, but taken it and taken it to use some inspiration. Um, if you saw Corinne's show last Thursday when she launched this, oh, my God, technique after technique beautiful makes all the way through um, so seriously go back and watch that show as well uh, but you can take advantage of this fabulous magazine that gorgeous kit as well in there and seriously get that crafting mojo going again and again and again with this fantastic magazine it's brilliant isn't it i love magazines just for that just to get you inspired maybe it's layouts it's going to inspire you about maybe it's color combinations you know you don't have to use the wild at heart elements you could be using anything and just take oh yeah i could put that and use it as a shaker in the middle and then put shadow at either side do whatever you wanted you know there are lots of different ways <coughs> to use the inspiration and you're going to find those as well still more people joining us um we've got i said about lillian stephanie says i want to wish everyone a happy thanksgiving just in case i don't get to watch tomorrow Tomorrow. hope you will be celebrating with family and friends thanksgiving's thursday isn't it third thursday in november i'm sure i remember that so yeah happy thanksgiving to everybody because i'm not on air on thursday you're on air on thursday aren't you on thanksgiving aren't debbie because we've got um something for the us yeah 
in terms of a clearance. And then on Thursday, uh, for our UK, so we've got a UK Be one here as all well. Day on uh, so I'm here, I'm here tomorrow for just one show at 6 pm, and then Thursday, I'm here all day okay. with the lovely Ben as well. Yeah. So, yes, thanks, I should be here for Thanksgiving on yeah. Thursday. Brilliant. Um, Stephanie says, I am excited to get the magazine. I think one of my orders is coming today. I hope it beats the heavy rain we are supposed to get this afternoon, evening, night, tomorrow morning. Will be a real soaker. That's funny, Stephanie, because I'm obviously here today. And I've just had a picture on WhatsApp from my husband while I was eating lunch. And he must have been walking the dog when um, one of our delivery drivers came round. And there was a big pile of lots of different boxes all stacked behind our gate. And he, <laughs> he just sent me a picture of all the boxes. It's like, yeah, I might have been doing some shopping on Sunday. So there we go. So yes, it is absolutely lovely when you know you've got orders coming. So I'll have all those to unpack when I get home tonight. OK, now I've got another one. We're going to change it from that into something else. Oh, that was good. We timed that one well, didn't we? I did a, I did like a, I did a Harry Potter wizardy one, and it changed. Oh, Charlotte, you get that's good one, that one. Right, this is all about stamps. Now, today's price, if you're looking at this, is twenty three pounds or twenty seven dollars. It says up there, it's an eight piece selection. It's coming out at less than three pounds per stamp set. If you're platinum, that's even less. It's just over two pounds. It's it's under three dollars. It's amazing value. So it, it's all Christmas themed. So you've got your holly jolly Christmas tree. I love that one. I'm imagining doing that. Stamp it in white, heat emboss it in white, and do a colour wash over it. Or, you know, just lovely stamping with colour washes is going to look gorgeous. On the same collection is the most wonderful tree. So as you can see, for both of these, the sentiment is weaved into the tree on there. And onto the tree on there, you've got, you know, this one says, oh, just a minute, sorry, I have to turn around. Oh, by golly, have a holly jolly Christmas. That's that one. And this one says, it's the most wonderful time of the year. I love the concept of those. Two Christmas trees, a bit different in each one, giving the sentiment. Now, this is a layering stamp. Really, really good if you've got your quick dry inks. Or you could do an ordinary ink, let it dry, and then heat emboss the one over the top. That looks amazing too. So that's your um, brush lettering, your merit, your Christmas wishes. Brilliant. Then you've got some more layering stamps. So this one's over the rooftops. And I'm actually, you can see it on here. So look, it says stamp the first layer of houses. Then you stamp the second layer of houses. So you do that one in a lighter colour, that one in a darker because it's coming forward. And then maybe in the black silhouette, you'll do the Santa sleigh. So you get that. If I turn it round, you can see you get one, two, and then three on there and some sentiments. In that same collection, you've got Christmas Village. So you've got the tree line, you've got the houses, and then you've got like the fence, the picket fence, you've got with the Christmas tree on as well. That reminds me of the Christmas tree in our village because that has like a picket fence around it. I think it's supposed to keep all the keep all the little darlings away from the tree. <laughs> Not saying it works. Then you've got to enjoy the season as well. Isn't that gorgeous? So you could in the real fine background you can do the trees. Then you've got the kids all having a lovely time. This is actually an extra layer because you've also got the layer of the of the church in. Then your front layer is the trees and the children skating. And then you've also got the, pick, the little fence with the snowman as well. And again, as it shows on here, you've got your sentiment. Oh, look at this. You've also got all the little snowflakes as well as another stamp and the, the moon or the sun, whichever one you want. All of these, I mean, I don't even know how many stamp elements you've got. You've got 10 in here. Now, this is perfect scene building. I'm going to turn it around because you can really see. Look at all those elements. I love these background ones. Background ones, and you've got the snowmen, you've got the um, snowflakes, but doesn't that look gorgeous? With this, I would really recommend you get your masket tape. And with Mary and Joseph, get your masket tape, and then you can be building these amazing scenes. Aren't they beautiful? I am a sucker for a script background. Mm, script background absolutely. in a stamp. Yeah, so one, two, three, four, five, all of these, we're not finished yet, six, seven, and, oops, eight. Now, if you're platinum, all eight of those, £18.40, 
$5.60. I believe it's over a 70% saving. So please, please don't wait. Make sure you pick that up really quickly because, yeah, once that's gone, we're not going to be able to bring that back. An amazing, amazing price. Everything, if you are into your stamping or you want to try stamping, you've got everything you need just there. There you go. Absolutely gorgeous. Now, you've got another deal for us. I have indeed. You want to see this yeah, one? Are you ready for this one? Are you ready for this one? Are you ready for this one? Yeah. Look at that magic touch of the fingers there. Eh? Look how great. Look at the price. Oh, wait till you see what you're getting for this one. Gift card holders. I talk about this every year, Corinne. My kids, although this year <clears throat> I've actually bought Liam something. Have you? I have. I've got to pick it up. I've got to pick it up tomorrow, actually. He's going to love me. Uh, Christmas and birthday, though, because his birthday is a week after Christmas. I mean, how dare he come out so close to Christmas? But I thought I'd combine it this year, but he's going to love me. Not going to say what it is, but he's going to love me. I'm going to be his number one mum. Not that I'm not already. However, I've always, 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 always given gift cards or money to somebody in the family. Not because I'm lazy, it's just that sometimes I just know what to get them. Mm. Um, so when it comes to gift cards, you want an older because... I'm not being funny, but some of those that you find in the shops, they're boring. Yeah. There's nothing interesting about them. And it's like just giving a card. So what you've got with this is three fabulous die sets. And I said die sets, there's even stamps in here. We'll start with Father Christmas. So this is what you're going to get in your collection. You are going to get the fabulous snowman, the components to build up Mr. Snowman. And this is where the magic happens because you simply pop him open. He's got a little area for you to be able to create the gift card where you're going to put the gift card. So on here, <clears throat> you've got the little areas where you're going to put your gift card into. And then all the fun parts to it. And then, of course, you've got all the stamps and you've even got your merry so you can mix up your merry with your Christmas and create there. And then including the pocket that allows it to go in. So if I just bring this in for a second with your father Christmas... You've even got the little pocket there and then oh, all yes. the little elements. I mean, <clears throat> badly chosen one for us right now here in the UK since the shop is no more. Although I have heard a rumour. They have. Have they brought it all have back? They? Oh, I've missed that Yes. One. Not all of it, but someone's bought some... I think someone's bought... An element of it. Elements of it, yes. Yeah. Wow. So it's going to be coming back. That's um, good. I Julia made this. You can tell where Julia likes to shop. Actually, to be fair, one of my favourite go-to stores here in the UK. Um, absolutely phenomenal to bring out some fun elements to this. So that's your Father Christmas. And you know what I love is that you don't just necessarily have to think of it as a gift card holder. Although this is a fabulous gift card holder as well. Because this could be a, a little bottle tag, but yes. then also hold a gift card inside it as well. Or money, if you want to put some money in there too. So it's entirely up to you. It's been designed to work with gift cards. And that's gift cards all across the world. It's not just here in the UK. It's your standard gift card that you would find across the globe and um, the other one in this is the festive snowman so it's all about the lovely snowman i absolutely love this one it is proper cute and again all the elements all the components to build up and create your snowman and then the stamps there as well and of course you've got your die set there which says your snow um, and again <clears throat> this is another one that could be a little tag at the top of your uh, bottles but where you place either a gift card or you simply add a sentiment onto it if you want to do that as well. Um, but everything on that die set enables you to create this. Can I just show you this one, though, Corinne? Go on. Oh, I, like I nearly wet myself when I saw it. It's so funny. It's a puddle oh, of snow. What's happened to the snowman? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it, it's melted. <laughs> I'm going to give a big shout out to Laura who made that one. That is hilarious. I looked at it and I thought, what? I, I, at first I thought, oh my God, has someone just, just stuck them on randomly? And then I realised it was a melted snowman. I just think that, that is, so is quite honestly, what a lot of fun. And what a lot of difference that would make than just giving one of those basic cards mm. that they give you with it. And then lastly, in there is the stocking. So you've got the Christmas stocking, exactly the same. You have the uh, shape to make the, car, uh, the stocking. You've got all the dice to decorate. You've got the gift card and they're all shaped to work with that particular design and then you've got the stamps on there as well So that enables you to create fun gift cards fun um, Christmas card making whatever kind of design you want to create it onto but for £11 and $14 before you even take off your club membership The lowest you'll pay is what you can see in the purple box there £8.80 
in the UK and $11.20 uh, for all our stateside friends as well. Absolutely phenomenal deal. We showed you a sneak peek of it this morning and um, we've still got some stock of it. But once it's gone, it has gone. We won't be bringing these back. So maybe right now is that opportunity. And like we said, Christmas comes every year. So you might have done all of them for this year, but this could be something that you, you store in your Christmas box. I've got one, I don't know about you, Corinne, but I've got two boxes. Well, I said two, it's actually three now. Three Calix units that are full of Christmas. Mm -hmm. And I keep them in there so I know exactly where I want to yeah. go and revisit some of them. And these, these would sit there firmly in there so you can bring them out every single year. Absolutely phenomenal value for money. A really, really great buy today, that one. They it really, is. really are. I mean, yeah, phenomenal price. Debbie, I've got a couple of questions for you, if I may, please. Yes. I've got Rhonda says, do you take everything out of the magazine and put the dies with your dies, stamps with the stamps, paper with the papers, or should I keep them together? I keep it all in the box. So I, I'm going back to when I collected, because I've been collecting our crisp, <laughs> back in. crafters inspiration in there i keep everything in the box so i don't put anything together so you wouldn't put this box with your wild at heart collection because it's sort of an extension you can do because it's an extension of there because that's what we've changed now with our magazine is that we've got themes of things that we've launched mm. so i can't i think the um, first oh, holy night, holy was the night. Last one. Um, bohemian was one before thank you yeah and um, i can't remember what number one was so did they're now. all like this is what we want to do was maybe give you that taster as well to, to get into that collection because if it's not been for you this this certainly will get you it wet your appetite and more but I keep everything in my box and I and keep my magazines together yeah. however that's a great idea Corinne popping it with your collection means that you then can extend and you can bring in other elements of it and if you were doing that I would definitely keep them in the box I wouldn't start separating no. them. I'd keep them in the box so that you know where they are and you know when you're thinking, oh, what was it that would go... Then you know where it is. It's straight in that box. You can straight get to that. So, yeah. Brilliant. Great question, okay. though. OK. Question of Tim C. These are the only two we've got at the moment. There's questions. It's, it's a quick question. It says, can you stamp onto Miricard? And if so, what ink do I need to use, please? So, stamping onto Miricard is very difficult because it is a call to cardstock and it's got a... a especially mirror, it's high shine mirror. Mm -hmm. So if you're gonna do that, you need something to be able to eat set possibly. You could get away with it, but I wanna be totally honest with you, Tim, it's not something I like. It's no. not my craft. I don't I don't feel like you get the best out of that when you're going on to onto those kind of things. You don't get the crisp image. You do don't you? know because no. you've got the coating over the top. It can be done, it can be achieved, but personally for myself, I, I steer clear of it because I don't think it gives you that I don't think it gives you the same kind of finish that you get on other cardstocks and other papers. With mirror cardstock, it is a very high shine content and it's mm -hmm. got that coating over the top that can make it difficult to do that and stamp onto the top. But like I said, it can be done. Um, it just about maybe heat set it, maybe use a permanent ink onto there. And even saying that, a permanent ink onto a coated cardstock can still, can still rub off, can't mm -hmm. it? It can still smudge. So Tim, if, if you want my honest opinion, no, Le it. no, uh, I wouldn't do it, but try it and see if you, yeah. you might like that result, but just try it with your uh, permanent inks or heat set it. But for me personally, I don't do that. No. No. I would be tempted to do it maybe onto some white or even with an inked background yeah. and then use your mirror as your matte and layer. Yes, yes. That's how I would tend to do it. So there you go. I hope that um, helps. Um, a couple of people said hello. Um, Christine Sayre says, I tried other craft magazines, but love how cra Crafter's Companion version is always presented. The free gifts you receive and the quality of the product, 100% recommended. It Thank is, you, yeah. And, and you know, that's the thing as well, Corinne. And you'll know yourself. I, I, I've always been drawn to magazines that give me inspiration, but I'm not going to lie. Some of the magazines out there, they don't make any sense. No. They put, they put random things together and... They, they, for me, they, I mean, they're probably good for some, but for me, they don't, they don't tie in with the thing. What we do with ours now is everything ties in together yeah. and everything works beautifully. It um, really so it's does. lovely to hear feedback like that, Christine. So thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah. Yes. Carol D says, whenever I lose my mojo, I go to the magazine collection and follow the inspiration in there. I use those cards for my inventory of need, of need if, if need fast cards. Yeah, exactly. And again, like you say, you can change them around, change the collections, really works there. Christine 
um, B. He says, hello from Altoona in Pennsylvania. Cold and rainy here. I watch the shows every day, but haven't had time to log in. Can't get ready in the morning without watching. Well, thank you. We're glad you join us every day, Christine. Rhonda says, those tr these tree stamps look amazing when they're embossed. That was these ones from the stamping bundle. Um, and then Shirl and Telesford says, hi, Corinne and Debbie. I'm a bit late today. I will like to get the, t she would like to get the today's bundle. It's chilly here in San Antonio. I'm going to show you that in a little while, a couple of minutes. Carol D says, one of my friends was a professional skater, so I had to make her the skating card out of that stamping bundle. Fabulous bundle, says Stephanie. And Carol D says, I have these sets because I have everything and they are so <laughs> much fun to play with. We have got some more comments, but actually I'll do those after we come back. We're going to give you time to check out anything that you've got so far. And we're going to have a quick video all about Crafters TV. You watch this and we'll be back in a few minutes. We get to know people from places and walks of life that we wouldn't come across in our everyday life if it wasn't for um, Crafters TV and doing what we do. I got so many lovely comments from people when I started doing the presenting and it was just really such a lovely um, feeling and it's nice that people keep messaging in, you know, we see the same, same people and we know you can build up that kind of relationship with those people so it's just the fact that people like what we do and they're pleased and I do love it when people send us photographs of the items they've made. We talk about customers but really the going as a customer come out as a friend. The support that I get is amazing. The messages I get are amazing. Me personally, it is personal interaction. I've never had the best of health. I've always been open about that uh, with our viewers at Crafters TV. So many people are in the same situation as me health-wise. Other people have got a completely different health issues. They understand and they relate to what I'm going through, what others are going through. So whether we interact on a crafting basis or whether we interact on a health basis, a personal basis, we're all there to support one another. It is incredible. The reaction of viewers when they come to meet us is worth all of the, the early mornings when we have to get up for our early morning shows. Some of the customers come on as craft ambassadors and things like that, craft along with us and being able to actually chat with them on air. Love it, I really love that connection with them. We've had lots of uh, shows where we've done like um, craft alongs especially, where we've had viewers craft along with us. We had a particular viewer, Joy, who joined us once before and she literally made me cry on air and Jo uh, because the things she said about us it really was quite humbling that there are people out there that watch us and and invite us into their living rooms and really treat us like family There once was a man who was very crafty. His name was Craig from Carnoustie. He joined the team on Crafters TV. Oh, crafty Scottish man craft. Soon may the crafty man come to bring us demos and inspiration. Each day when his crafting is done, he might do a Facebook Live. He wanted to prove he was the man, but he lost at Craft Wars to Leanne. But two weeks later, he beat Jan. Oh, crafty Scottish man craft. Soon may the crafty man come to bring us demos and inspiration. Each day when his crafting is done, he might do a Facebook Live. He did so well on Crafters TV, Sarah sent him off to Germany, where he did some work for QVC. Oh, crafty Scottish man craft. Soon may the crafty man come to bring us demos and inspiration. Each day when his crafting is done, he might do a Facebook Live. His crafting skills, they aren't half bad. In fact, I'd say they're totally rad. That's mainly down to his favorite foam pads. Oh, crafty Scottish man craft. Soon may the crafty man come to bring us demos and inspiration. Each day when his crafting is done, he might do a Facebook Live. The crafters, they loved him a lot for his charm and skill. They went quite potty. They nicknamed him the hardy Scotty. Oh, crafty Scottish man craft. Soon may the crafty man come to bring us demos and inspiration. Each day when his crafting is done, he might do a Facebook Live. In the crafting world, he's standing tall. He's the best Scottish crafter of them all. Catch him Monday to Friday on his wake-up call. Oh, crafty Scottish man craft. 
Soon may the crafty man come to bring us demos and inspiration. Each day when his crafting is done, he might do a Facebook Live. Hello and welcome back. Right, we're in the last half hour of this second show of the day. Where's the day going? It looks very dark outside here. I think it might be getting a bit dark out there. So yeah, I hope you're all warm and snugly, safe and dry wherever you are. And uh, thank you for joining us. Like I say, about 30 minutes left. Um, still time to get some amazing deals left in. Um, Carol D says, the effect these cards give is so much bang for the effort. They are so easy, but look so complex. That was the um, gift tag ones, I think. Oh, Stephanie says, I've just got those gift cards. Um, Betty Weaver says, because I don't have enough to do getting ready for our company, our on tea day, I think Thanksgiving day, I started the huge cosy cottage easel die and of course I was just winging it but now I want to see it in use. Yeah, there we go. And if you look in the middle of the magazine, there's loads of inspiration on how to use that. Carol D says, my magazine is waiting for me to get home to be delivered. I'm excited to get it. And Geoffrey Langley says, happy Tuesday, Corinne and Debbie and all the fantastic and great CTV crews. Yes, we've got uh, Charlotte and Dean and Alex on socials. And uh, it's Tracy. It's um, Tracy out today. She's um, in on an extra day here, um, uh, doing, getting everything ready. And they are busy getting everything ready. Right, you've seen our Charlotte's Chase a Deal on here. We're now looking at our Black Friday show stop a deal. Oh my goodness me, this has been so popular. There's five elements in here and you are gonna be saving so much by buying them all in this deal. The first thing I'm gonna show you is the 100 jewel tipped markers. These are a water-based um, pen. If I turn it round, this is the best way. I didn't even notice this on the back. Look at this. Look at that colour palette. Isn't that absolutely amazing? They are dual tips. So you can see we're doing brush lettering. You can do colouring. It's entirely up to you. They are water-based tips. The details are down here. So there you go. These should be £49. Go that way, that way. £49 just for that. You're only paying £90 today. So there you go. For £40, you're getting everything else. That's the first one. And the next one you're going to get is your bumper pack of refillable tape pens you asked we listened and this is what you have got absolutely brilliant so you're going to get two of your ready to go tape pens so you've got get it the right way around dotty and your, um, your really strong one if i turn it around that way you can see i love this that the, the straight edge one the super strong is now in the um, raspberry pink a lot easier to see the difference you know when we had them both in purples a light purple and a dark purple i could never remember easy to see really easy to do you've got this cap on the top that pops off just like this there we go pop that off then you press on this piece here like that they separate then this piece because it's used up will be discarded you'll get another one out of here and then you'll just load them back together oh, making sure you don't catch them like i just did then pop them back together click oops there we go that will click once it clicks you've got a little hole there put the little um element from there in there and then click it back on there. And then the bit that you use to separate them, you now put your hand on to work. They're a much more ergonomic shape. We worked out this 360 metres of tape pen in the th across the 12 um, pieces, because you've got two solids and f uh, um, five in each of them refills. 360 metres, 8p per metre. If you're platinum, 8p per metre for um, the UK, 11 cents per metre brilliant value now i'm going to just mention this one and then pass it over to debbie because she's got hers out and she loves hers this is the little desk vacuum so there we go vernon is it vernon i think it is vernon, vernon. Ben's vernon over here there this is the desk uh, vacuum oh turn it off it's got two settings why do i need the little vacuum is part it? of the showstopper deal it is yeah all the details are down here uh, if you want it individually honestly it's phenomenal this one because it's a craft room essential so if you're anything like me and you take your dies out and all the bits drop all over either your floor or onto your ta and it's nine times out of ten it's straight onto my glass mat i'm forever scooping up and flinging me in the bin. I don't even have to worry this time because this little gadget is going to be your best friend. It's been mine for the last two weeks since I've had mine. Um, this isn't mine, this is Ben's Vernon. As you can see, decorated with the lovely googly eyes. 
if you want to add a bit of character to yours and you want to name yours you could do exactly the same i love how he's positioned those eyes seriously fabulous now it really is a very useful tool you're also getting some attachments with this you've got the little what i call them or precision nib that you're going to pop on there you've got a little brush to clean all the insides out as well there's glitter still absolutely everywhere from our gorgeous sorry yesterday who decided to pick up glitter to show just how fantastic this is but it really is and the lovely thing about it is there's no batteries there's no electricity it's run from a charger and guess where it runs from have a guess where it runs from oh yes it comes from the back of your gemini 2 so if i just move that out of the way for a second you simply pop your cable in my cable lives in there now and you are going to just attach it to the very top and then you're going to charge that up and then literally and if i just pop that in let me get that the right way around debbie use your eyes it's now charging and it has a little light that comes on when it's charging up so it's absolutely fine so while your machine is switched on you can be charging that up now i told you earlier corinne and it's true i charged mine up it's still going strong two weeks later i've not had to charge it That's and amazing. i use it every day every single time i craft um, the two setting speeds there is the first press of the button you can hear him working it's for you to pick up and if you want more of a suction second one and then just run it around the most satisfying noise in the world let me tell you right you now you were cutting up pieces of paper i have to, been just, cutting up pieces of paper to, just to, <laughs> to vacuum up i absolutely you. have for and no it's other a reason it's as simple as that and when you want to turn him off you just press his little nose again that's why he's done it you know that's why he's done it and then when you want to empty it you just take off that top like I said, all the extra little bits that might get sucked up into there, you're just going to drop it in, then take it to your bin, empty it straight out into your bin, and then no more like I've been doing when I scoop it off my desk, offer it on my lap, offer it on the floor, about 5% of it in the bin. Yeah. And then I have to get my real Hoover out and Hoover up as well. It made me laugh because I saw Sarah yesterday and she was hoovering clothes. Oh, wait, Debbie, I think it might have been Debbie. Oh, rip bits up off a of Oh, wow. As well. uh, but it really is a phenomenal little gadget. You're going to love yours, whether you're going for that showstopper deal, whether you're going for Little Vernon or New New, I've heard the other one being called, which is in reference to Teletubbies here in the UK. I'm sure, do you get your states as well? I think you do. Teletubbies, my, uh, my little ones, they're obsessed uh, with a little New New that goes around yeah. cleaning everything up. I quite like that one. I think I might call mine new new. Uh, but seriously, you're going to love this. It is a craft room essential that we've been asking for. And the guys have finally delivered it because there's lots of other ones out there. But it's lovely to have, especially if you have got the G2, let me tell you. One that matches, that lovely yeah. raspberry colour. I want you to rest assured, though, if you haven't got a G2, it doesn't matter. Anything with a USB plug, that can plug into. And you can pick them up, especially in supermarkets and things oh, like that. So you can cheap. pick them up. Peep? Peep? You can pick them up for next to nothing and you can simply charge it that way as well by running it into the electricity and charging that way. So don't think you've got to have a G2 to work and operate Ben's Vernon, um, but you don't because it simply is just a USB port that you need. And I can promise you, you're going to use it like I do now every single time I craft to wipe up and keep my desk really clean. And I know you picked yours up today, aren't you? Uh -huh. You've got yours today. I know Craig's got his, I know Debbie's got hers. Um, it's it, Honestly, everybody needs one of these in the little life to keep that craft desk really tidy, really clean. It picks up things like glitter, as you saw, sorry, yesterday, bits of you know bits of your die cuts um it's picked up gems i knocked my gems over the other day i was like you, oh my use goodness if you're a sewer with all your little threads I, well, I, would, I would say so because it's the brushes that yeah. suck up and put, pull that in i mean i personally haven't used it with threads because that, that's I not me but could. i you would imagine so same pieces of fabric but threads yeah because what work. it does is it picks up and then sucks it into mm -hmm. the center and that's what that does and then if you want to go in for that precision one you just add your little nozzle to the bottom so you can use it and you can hand hold it as well so it doesn't necessarily just have to glide across it i don't know it always looks it, it looks even more like new new doesn't it it does now <laughs> It absolutely does now, but yeah, it can go into the precision things Brilliant. as well. Um, and then that's how you clean it. You just unattach that. And when you want to clean, you've got a little brush. I swear to God, every time I open it up, Corinne, more glitter. I thought I cleaned all the glitter out. There's yet more there. Oh, Sarah. She could have used big chunky glitter. She's used the no. finest glitter yeah. known to man to pick up. Once but however, you. just shows you what you can do with it. You can. Yeah. I remember seeing somebody using, there was a, a, um, a 
one of Sandra's Santangle events. You know when you're rubbing off your bits of um Oh, eraser, absolutely, yes. And you get that. You know, it's brilliant for picking up little bits of eraser as well, um, you know, on all your little... Pen, you know, if you sharpened your pencil and little bits have gone on your desk and things like that. So don't just think it's for die cutting. It's whatever craft you do. So, you know, if you're an artist and you might have little shavings or a razor shavings, it's going to work too. Now, I did mention there's five elements to this Black um, Friday showstopper. The final two are the new paper trimmer and the replaceable blades. Now, the details down here, oh, that way, that way, are for the paper trimmer. Please don't be confused by it saying a 3 inch by 12 inch. Debbie will show you it's not really 3 inches by 12 inch. That's the folded up version. Now, this is included in the Black Friday showstopper. Absolutely phenomenal. Debbie's been using it all day. Cuts off slithers, cuts her cardstock down. She's been taking out the centre of her cardstock so she can use it for other things. Absolutely, you... I don't think you know how much you need a paper trimmer. You go, oh, I've got a guillotine. You need a paper trimmer. And until you get a paper trimmer and start using it, I don't think you realise. But the fact that we're then going to give you the blades as well, because the last thing you want is a dull blade you've got there. You can emboss with this, you score with this, you can change the blades really easily, and they're included. Yeah, absolutely. And I just want to like just say, because I know I've, I've seen some posts out there about people saying, what do you need a 3x12 trimmer for? It's not a 3x12 trimmer. It is a 3x12 in size. That's the only thing that this is. It's the size of it. It makes it portable, lightweight, easy to pop into your craft bags. And when you're traveling, for me, it's an essential. It goes absolutely everywhere with me. Um, for the people that have been asking the difference between this and the Violet Studio, there isn't one. Um, there simply isn't one. It's just a different colour. Violet Studios is a brand within our brand. We've now just brought our Crafters Companion logo um, for the obviously for, for here when we're here to be able to use. So it, there's no difference there whatsoever. Um, and I'll show you why it isn't 3 by 12 because you've got the extendable arm. And if I just lift that up, this now makes this really big. This is a big portable trimmer now because now it takes anything from anything, and I say anything, to be fair, I've used three, A3 cardstock yeah, onto here. Um, it goes up to 14.25 inches, so that's 14 and a quarter inches, all the way down to 12. I did say to you there's a tiny little bit more than extra than 12 because the 12 stops here, uh, but there's just that little bit extra. So you can get it comfortably, 12 by 12 cardstock onto there, including your A3. Um, for me, um, it's simply one of those tools that I can't live without and I always champion our guillotines they are absolutely phenomenal but for me the thing that I get out of this and I'll do it again Corinne mm -hmm. I'm going to cut this to down to seven by let's go to seven by five this time one of those card um, blanks that we talk about a lot simply very easy to use and Honestly, cuts like a dream. This cardstock is 240 GSM. I will show you in a second what you can also do with it in terms of cardstock. But for me, it's having this option. So when we talk about not wasting your cardstock, your lira is often referred to as taking out the centre or gutting or other words that you'll, you'll totally get. Um, and also people will say to me, well, how do you know how to come down here? Because there's no markings down here. Well, the markings are actually on the lift up and all there yeah. so you can see now I've got from 0 to 5 mm -hmm. so if I want to take that to 4 inches I'm just going to lift that up for a second because there's a little bit in your hand there's, there's lines on it isn't it so you can see to yeah. line it up yeah and it does mean and there's a little handle that you pull up there as well um, but if you want to just cut out slithers you absolutely can but it makes it easy to lift off so you don't have to move that to the top and the bottom because if you do of course what you're going to do Corinne is you're going to cut it um, so for this bit when you're wanting to trim out or you know take out those pieces in the center this now means that you as a crafter get more for your cardstock I always do this when I'm at home whenever I'm prepping a kit I know you do Corinne mm -hmm. um, it's like Craig says when we're here although we don't admit this to Tracy but we're not as frugal we as cardstock which we really we should be we don't have time to be fair we should be shouldn't we, we should. um, but now you've created that lovely frame so for taking out the center pieces and then of course it does cut like slithers as well let's go I mean this is so your markings have got your inches but you've also got your centimeters onto the top and when I say it cuts slithers 
it cuts slivers of cardstock and I mean genuinely it's that slithery you can't Where's even it see this here look this is what I wanted to show you let me get my pokey tool into the head Corinne because it is accurate it really is superbly accurate and it's why I champion my guillotine but you can't do this on a guillotine and that's why a paper trimmer is an invaluable piece of equipment if you love doing things like your iris folding and you want to cut those strips down um, all the other paper techniques that you do as well um, you still I mean look at that that's a precise strip where else I mean apart from a guillotine you could do it on a guillotine but where else could you do it in terms of heavier weight cardstock now we had the question asked earlier about mount board I personally do not use this for mount board no nope. um, I know one of our design team members said she's used it to uh, start the markings off onto mount board and then take a craft knife I use my guillotine for this um, oh Debbie you're not going to cut it when you've got <laughs> what are you doing? I had it raised up. I'm like, what are you doing, Debbie? Uh -huh. um, but just to show you, this is our multi-purpose card stock, or as it's now known, card. I know. It's bizarre. Uh, but 300 GSM, this will tackle that as well. It tackles um, things like um, your 310 GSM in Central Repel. Uh, glitter cardstock I've cut glitter cardstock with it as well um, and if I can find some for later I'll show you uh, but it really is a very useful tool but it isn't three inches by 12 I promise you it's not three inches that's just the size of it when it's all folded in it gives you as a crafter a paper trimmer option to be able to use it to create all of this kind of thing including all the things that, oh I've lost my little sliver now it's disappeared it's that tiny uh, but seriously that's the kind of precision cut that you can get with it you'll hear me, myself and Craig always talk about our paper trimmers I had to have this one well I say I had to I had to because I was demonstrating it this weekend so I had to have one uh, but I would have got it anyway yeah. Corinne because it's a really useful tool and one that again as a crafter you need in your life if you've never invested in one you can either go for this individually the details are on the bottom individually which you can do if you want to however it's a fantastic deal in Showstop it that Showstop is. is a phenomenal it, it really, really is it really is and the other thing that you're going to get is your little blades as well your little v blades as well so those are your replacement heads to go into that trimmer as well now all of those elements 90 pounds 125 dollars you've just saved 53 well nearly 54 um, pounds or nearly 61 dollars but your platinum price is even better look at that it's just about half price if you are platinum 72 pounds or a hundred dollars that's going to give you all five elements the pens the tape pens the vacuum the trimmer and the replacement blade so please please think about that absolutely amazing craft room essentials i love it when you're going to get something like this your show stopper here of things that you need things that are going to help you to make your crafting better and easier brilliant okay so a um, couple of comments coming in mary beth doyle says she loves sorry i missed that was she supposed to be comments in a minute you carry on Corey, you carry on we're going to revisit it was all right we're going to revisit some of the best deals that have been the, what we call the best sellers this hour i can't listen while i'm talking <laughs> i could hear and i just misheard i am so <laughs> sorry i must apologize right i'll do these quite quickly then uh, mary beth door says the craig sea shanty from the break is still a favorite song but i like them all carol d says the photos of craig's holiday decorations put my measly efforts to shame and but she loves the new violet studio markers for kids uh, brenda munro says oh those cool are uh, cool tape pens stephanie says i like the markers for my granddaughter she loves water coloring and the pen she currently has are running out perfect timing um i loved when sarah and ben were showing this and ben put the eyes on his that's on the <laughs> vacuum yes it's not ben's anymore corinne it's not, it's not ben's it's it ours it's, it's coming ours. on this side of the I building you were taking it then <laughs> um craig moss watkins says hello from flagstaff arizona hello craig um i am ordering the refillable glue pens brilliant really well um oh Stephanie says, Debbie, the little vacuum cleans up the floors around where you're sitting. She doesn't have rugs. You've got like I've got laminate floor in my craft room. Yes. Put it on yeah. The way it goes. There we go. And Brenda bought it for Christmas presents for people. Um, ooh. And Rhonda says that little nozzle attachment on the vacuum seems like it would fit in the window sills. Yeah. You know those little gaps. Yes. Yeah. Oh, right. Okay. Do you know the answer to this, uh, Debbie? Stephanie says, I have the Violet, paper, Violet Studios paper trimmer. Yep. Will the blades, yes. these ones, yes. for the CC 
fit in the violet yes, one? Yes, they will. Yes. She's saying yes before I've even finished the yeah. question. <laughs> yeah. So we've been we've been wanting the re we've been wanting those for the, so obviously with your violet studio it's a gold one. We haven't got the gold replacement one, so you can use the purple one into there. Um, but yeah, that's absolutely what you can do. Perfect. There you go. So yeah, if you've already got that, then do that. Okay. I'm sorry now. I'm going to zip it and let you show us some of the best-selling ones. <laughs> I am so sorry about no, that. No, do you know what? It's lovely, and, and it's addressing some of the questions. We, what have we said here all the time? We're interactive. So mm -hmm. if there's anything you want to ask, absolutely. And I know that that's been another question on everyone's um, minds. Uh, minds, is do they fit the Violet Studio? Yes, they do. It's the same paper trimmer. It, Violet Studio is our brand. We manufacture it, Violet Studio. It's just a separate, it's like Spectrum Noir is a brand within our brand. It's Violet Studio, is that? So it's exactly the same, and they will fit in there. I can guarantee it because I heard it from the boss. And uh, seriously, I mean, to have that replacement means that if you have got a violent, I always violent say it, I, I call it violent. I don't come on, Debbie. There's nothing violent about Violet Studio. I just can't say the word sometimes. I was doing it all weekend, Violent Studio. <laughs> like, what the heck? <laughs> demonstrating I mean like oh no no there's nothing violent about it uh, but yeah absolutely it will fit into there so those kind of comments those questions don't ever feel like anything's a draft question we do our very best to answer it if we can't answer it we will pass it on to somebody who can so don't ever be afraid to ask that's what Perfect. I say uh, so we going back over oh, God, time just flies by Seriously, one of the proven runaway successes of this uh, craft fault, this Black Friday craft fault, are these half creator card dies, um, which are incredible because not only the half creator card, the half price. Um, and that's half price minus your club membership the lowest price is 20 pounds or th uh, 23 dollars for when you see the size of these dies you'll totally understand why this has been flying out of the door the size of these dies they're so intricate but chunky great big dies that create a card in an instant and the difference between these to a regular create a card is that it cuts in and around so you've got the inner part that stays connected into your cardstock and then the outer surround that creates that half feature which is what i absolutely love i'm always drawn to the bells one because i love to color this one corinne so i'll back it onto some cardstock yeah. and then color it looks stunning when I you do that absolutely beautiful you've got that gorgeous and it, it really is a beautiful yuletide wreath that you can be putting your centers into there you can see how the die works from the top to the bottom that's the little notch one side cuts out and you can see the raised element instantly and then the other side hasn't so that's the bit that stays connected into your cardstock so these are absolutely phenomenal dies and i'll show you a few samples in a second i mean talk about a statement poinsettia it's just incredible it's called the joyous uh, poinsettia absolutely stunning look at these Talk about making cards easy. These are absolutely phenomenal. Marie has backed it onto some white cardstock um, and then fussy cut around there and then coloured it in and it looks beautiful. My favourite has to be this one of Marie's samples. I love this. I think it's absolutely glorious. Paper piece, colour, add extra pieces on like your glitter cardstock. Looks phenomenal. Take it into your box making. Who says it has to be a creator card just for creating a card? Take it into your box making as well like Bianca's done. Um, absolutely phenomenal. The same die, but look how sensational that looks. Keeping it really simple and classy. Oh my God. Craft card and gold card stock looks sensational. These are incredible dies at the most incredible price. We launched them this Christmas, this event, during June, July time. We launched them this year. £25, $29 is phenomenal. But look at the platinum price. £20 or $23.20 for three really big dies that simply create Christmas cards in a gif, just like that in an instant. They're stunning. So that's why it's been proving to be popular. Fabulous price, fabulous product so much creativity get them in your basket whilst they're at that crazy price because i don't know how long that will be available for brilliant okay i have got another one of our amazing deals that's been really popular today this is a christmas shaped card basis so you've got stamps and dies now remember this remember the price and remember this 43 stamps and one 
129 dies. That's right, 129 dies. Even at the original price of nearly £80 or about $100, this was amazing value. So first of all, you've got your cheerful snowman. So this is the piece that's going to make your card shape, just like that. And then you've got all of the accessories. You've got all the different hats. You've got the scarf. You've got the gloves. You've got the antlers. This little bit is a bit that you can put on the bottom because otherwise he's going to rock and he's going to fall over. It's just like his shadow. You're going to get those. Then you get all the stamps up here, the facial expressions. Now, you do get, um, like, his nose and I think you've got some dyes down here. Have you got, you've got the nose and some eyes. But then you can then... And there's another nose. But you can then add these on as well and the sentiment. You've then got your gingerbread house, which is absolutely gorgeous. And I'm looking at all of these lovely little gingerbread, the candy canes, and I'm thinking about taking those outside of here. And again, the stamps. Then you've got the lovely Christmas cheer, which is the Christmas tree. Again, a really, really easy card shape to do. And finally in this section is your Jolly Penguin. Isn't he absolutely gorgeous? All of those bits. Now, all of the bits are interchangeable if you want, but you can be putting on things like, oops, you've got this lovely little box with the penguin on the top. That could be a card shape in its own right. You've got him there, just coloured in beautifully on a card. The Christmas tree can go 2D on your card or it can do 3D as oops, sorry, as an easel card. There, just like that. You've got your lovely snowman, which is just here. There we go. There he is. Absolutely gorgeous. Or you've got your gingerbread house like that. Really, really versatile. Now you're going to get these today, £39. $49, which is amazing, amazing value. Your platinum is going to go down to £31.20 or £39.20. Well, oh, Stephanie said thank you for answering a question. You're very so welcome. So there we go. Right. You're absolutely very welcome. We've got One time. more cheeky little last deal again. Okay. And I know we've recapped on this earlier, but again, proving to be a runaway success. I'll tell you why. Look at the price. £14.19. Don't hang around. Get these in your basket if you've been eyeing them up. Look at the platinum price for all you thousands of members that are in the platinum and club 11 pounds 20 or 15 dollars 20 for six well five die sets two different dies in each one creating 10 dies for you to create some really beautiful pieces i'm going to whip through these really quickly my favorite i love it is the uh, snow crystals they can be a focal part of your card they can be that little decorative element they can be that little finishing touch or a really loads of different ways you're going to be able to use them entwined holly you've got the fabulous uh, ring out those bells you've got the um Christmas decor and then also last but not least the poinsettia splendor which is absolutely sensational and these can be used in a whole host of ways whether there be something that just highlight your you know your sentiments whether there be something that really do finish off by adding different colors into those color them look at that it's always I love this one that Caroline did because this is the kind of thing that you can be doing with them we could have been really lazy we could have given you a die set with two of the same dies in there we didn't we created two different ones in there for you to get the most out of them it is a phenomenal deal a phenomenal deal all of those die sets that's five die sets with 10 dies in there £14.19 any day of the week is a fabulous price. Take off your club membership, the lowest you'll go to if you're brand new to Club Inspired today or you're a platinum member is eleven twenty or fifteen dollars twenty. Honestly, seriously, Corinne. Um, I love them. I, lo I remember when I launched them and I said, I'm really excited about the launch. And they're going, a corner die? Why are you getting excited about mm. a corner die? So much you could do with them. Scrapbook pages, home decor, boxes, cards, tags, the lot. You've run out That's of words, all I'm going to say. We're going to run out of words to say, but seriously, you want these? I know you do. If you haven't got them, take advantage of that phenomenal, phenomenal prize. Seriously, amazing. Really, really is worth picking those up. I hope you've managed to pick up some amazing deals today. We've had some fantastic deals have you been have you picked up the showstopper that we're going to show you um we're going to dedicate the next show a lot more time to, to to that one later we'll go over that have you got the black friday deal have you got some of the christmas black friday offers you know we've shown you card bases we've shown you frames cardstock pen um ink pads we've shown you so many different brilliant brilliant christmas black friday deals so you know hopefully you've been able to pick up something you want the comments been sounding like you've absolutely loved them you've loved 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 the inspiration and all the prices 
they are just amazing now debbie and i are going to take a break now we're going to go off have a little bit of tea yes. five minutes to put our feet up and then we will be back in one hour not long one hour 6 p.m uk time so it's um 1 p.m eastern it's 10 a.m specific time please come back and join us it is all about our launch party we've got some amazing demos i've seen debbie's demos absolutely loving them all about all of these and the kingfisher please come back and see us very shortly <laughs> 